Good morning, everybody. This is Elizabeth Wood, Wood Education Blog 43. I am going to talk to you about Summer Moon Well in this video. It's, it's my urgent message to all of you, so please listen carefully what I have to say. Now I'll see you on the next page. Um, good morning everyone. This is Eva Elizabeth Wood, Wood Education Blog 43, and welcome you to my channel. How is everybody doing out there? Well, <laughs> I'm doing okay this morning. I am not too happy with what is going on on the social media. Uh, the law authorities are... I'm not happy with with the rumors and the slanders and the gossip going around about the Wells family. So I titled this video, Rumors, Slanders, Gossip, Must Stop, about the Wells family. Well, let me tell you, it's none of our business to make judgment on that family. All we can do is to pray for them and to pray uh, that we can find or they can find uh, <clears throat> uh, Summer Moon Wells. Now, <clears throat> a lot of speculation going on and, and the, the law authorities is not going to stand for rumors and gossip and slanders and they're, they're not going to go on the search for summers on those information that they're receiving into their law offices. We are not to judge anybody for that matter. We are not to gossip or spread lies and speculate. Speculation is another form of rumor or, or gossip. Slander is saying lies about somebody to bring down their repetition, to defame them. Now, <clears throat> what they do with their lives, the Wells family lives, what they do with their lives is their business. No one else's. We have no right to to judge them and say say things that will aggravate and make them suffer more than what they're suffering now. We are not to do that. We can help by praying, praying to Jesus, praying to God to help the, the responders to, to search for this little five-year-old girl. And as far as being a busybody, being nosy, not minding your own business, that is not called for. We can have compassion on the family. But to spread rumors and, and slanders and gossip and speculating this happened and that happened and this could happen and that happened. No. Let me tell you. We were not there when summer was has disappeared. We were not there to see anything of her disappearance. We're not in Utah. We're in their homes. And then the rumors and the slanders and the gossip, 
that gets spread around on the social media, on the internet, and none of it is true, and a lot of it is being reported to the law authorities to to act on the tips, which takes them nowhere. Uh, uh, slander and gossip are lies. They are rumors. And the law authorities are acting on these rumors and slanders and gossip. I, my, my heart goes out for the family. It really does. I'm not married. I don't have any children of my own. But I, I can sort of understand the feelings, maybe what they have. But, but to, to talk about the mother putting the little girl in the well. <laughs> that really, that really got me. This woman that does the videos here on YouTube, I, I wish she would not be speculating. She's saying things which I think is a lie or a slander. She wasn't there. She doesn't know what really took place. All she is seeing is the videos and the pictures that she went on the internet and, and find and, and put on her video. That's all she does. She wasn't there. She doesn't know a thing about what happened there. She, she did not witness her disappearing. She, not, she doesn't know the family. Nobody does. And it's not our business. I mean, how how would you like it that some, if you had your daughter and your daughter up missing, and the social media will say all things that are not true about the situation, how would you like it? And you would just be angry at these social media. Me, me you know. We do not do that. We, it's sad. It's really sad. We must not speculate. And we must not, I mean, we have our own opinion of what has happened. Keep it to ourselves. Just only pray. Just pray to God that they will find this little girl wherever she is and stop speculating stop spreading rumors stop slandering uh, those are lies gossip lies and these authority they get paid for searching they get paid for going out and searching for a little girl Watch how you judge people. Do not hate the Wells family. Show compassion towards them. They don't need your hate. They don't need your lies and gossip and slander. They, they're suffering enough right now, hoping that their, their little girl will have a decent burial if that could be the case or come back alive but we all have the feeling that she might not come back alive or she does I it, it's not my place to 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 be a busybody and a gossip in other people's affairs. I keep my mouth shut. And you should too. You can make a comment like, I'm sorry, you lost your little girl, your girl disappeared. We are, we are all praying 
or you. That's the best way to say it. it you know, this family need to be uplifted in the spirit. They need to, to, to be shown that there are lots of people out there that love them, even though they don't know them at all, but they love them. That they, that they wish and want to, for that little girl to be found. We all do. That's our heart. That's our compassion that we have. And this lady, um, crime obsessed on me. She is, she is not minding her own P's and Q's. She's not. She's saying things that is not true. When, by saying that the woman was put, the, you know, the mother put the girl in the well. That really grabbed me, and, and I said, uh-uh. How does she know that? And it must be a rumor or a gossip that went around about that little clip. I keep asking Jesus to direct the searching team to go out and find that little girl. Imagine how heartbroken they are and how exhausted and tired they are. They will not give up until they find that little girl. She's five years old and she's the cutest little thing I see. So people, just watch what you say on social media. Lift up the Wells family. Show your compassion and understanding. And pray to God that Jesus will direct them to that little girl. She's five years old and she's the sweetest thing I I I, I see on on the social media and on the news. There are other children missing, but they are not getting the uh, attention that that summer moon well is getting. Pray for them. Show your, show your compassion. I'm sorry that this had to happen. It could happen to any family that have a little girl or a little boy. All of a sudden, they disappear and they can't find them. Then they call the 911 to tell the, the dispatch that their little, little child is missing. And please, I beg you, everybody, out there on YouTube and the social media, have compassion. Don't hate, don't say hateful things to the Wells family. That's not showing love. Forget about their past. What they've done in their, in their personal lives is nobody's business and we should not be talking about their personal lives. We should not even spread it on the social media or the news or what have you, on the internet. That, that's what we should not do. So, that's all I got to say. I hope YouTube will have a lot of people watching this. Thank you for watching. This is Wood Education Blog 43. Ever and Elizabeth Wood saying so long. I will see you the next time on YouTube and the World Wide Web.